All right, now let's, let's go a little bit more off the reservation again. We've got the Gamma Core Neurostimulation Device. What the heck is that? Uh, gamma Core is a uh, non-invasive vagal nerve stimulator. Um, it's used just here in the neck. Um, it has a, a signal which, activa which, uh, which will stimulate the vagal nerve, the vagus nerve, um, has an, has an effect on trigeminal uh, processing in the brain. It's been licensed for the acute treatment of episodic cluster headache in the US based on two randomized sham controlled trials called ACT-1 and ACT-2. And it's been licensed for the acute treatment of migraine um, in the US based on an Italian study called PRESTO. Okay, and in your experience, have you used it? Oh yes, I, I've used the gamma core in episodic cluster in cluster headache, reasonably extensively. Uh, it does what it says on the randomised control trial charge. It's useful for acute treatment uh, of episodic cluster headache. It's it, the useful thing about it in many ways is effective, but it's also pretty well tolerated. It doesn't have any um, it doesn't have any real downsides apart from having to stick it on your neck. Yeah, you put stickers on your neck. Well, no, you, you, it's got little electrodes on the on the edge. You put a bit of gel on. You put it on the neck like this, and you stimulate for two minutes. That's it? Yes. You don't, you don't well, you walk do it around twice. with this thing on? No, 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 and then you put it down. So, so how long does it take to work for uh, people with cluster? Within 15 minutes. The, really? The, the pain-free rates were res and relief rates were at 15 minutes. You know, it's a, uh, cluster headaches is a horrible problem. Um, one of well, the she called them suicide headaches. Yeah, exactly. Well, that's a bad thing. Um, and one of the problems with triptans and cluster headache is that cluster headache tends to be in males. They tend to be often smokers. And a smoking male who's middle-aged uh, often has other problems going along it's with a the cholesterol. Idea. Yeah, it's a bad idea. So it's, it's very useful to have an alternative uh, to uh, triptans in that, in, that, in that group. Did I hear you say in a conference that you had a patient with a beard? And yeah. then he, um, yeah. why don't you go ahead and yes. say this? I have a patient with a beard who shaved his beard just uh, in a... Uh, a, a, like a gamma core shape, so to speak, <laughs> so he can always place it in the right in the, in the Did right position. Did he symmetrically so that it was cosmetic? No, no, acceptable. no. He's happy. I'll just do it. You know, he's very happy to wear it. <laughs> so, so to speak. You put this on briefly. And hold then you it take on. Take it yeah. off. You hold it on. Two minutes. And what percent of the people that try it get relief? Oh, the pain-free rates um, at 15 minutes are about 30 percent. For cluster. Or for yeah, for cluster. Okay, now 30 percent is not huge, no. but compared to zero, or lots of bad drugs, sure yeah. it is. Well, it's, it's, it's excellent compared to, um, compared to not having a choice, uh, to have it if the triptan is contraindicated. The other thing that's used in cluster headache is uh, oxygen therapy, mm -hmm. which is great. It's effective. Um, there's good randomized controlled trial data, but this, it's a little inconvenient during the day to lug the cylinder around. So having, uh, uh, like most of the things we've been talking about, try to develop a portfolio of, of, what's a, of therapy so the patient can deal, can deal with the attacks and be at work and continue, the, continue their life is important. You know, it's interesting you bring up oxygen. If, you've, if you have read the book, The Martian, the, the, the stranded astronaut who got headaches went right to the oxygen, right. turned it up to 100% and said that it worked. Okay. How does it work? Well, in cluster headache, um, we have, it, it works, and it probably works through turning off um, some uh, nerves that are in the brain, the brain stem, that are driven from, um, that, are, that are driven from in the cluster headache process. There's a group of nerve cells called the superior salivatory nucleus in the pons, a little bit of detail, um, that drive some part of the trigeminal nucleus and you can turn those off with, uh, you turn those off with oxygen. That's fascinating. Yeah. And it, I want to get back to the gamma core for a minute. Does it work without other drugs on board? Yes. And does it work better if you're able to take some other drugs? Most patients, I've got some patients who use it adjunctively with oxygen and they will say the combination's better. I try and discourage people from using many, many things. Mm -hmm. I think that um, trying to nut down on something that works, a single thing that works, and focusing on doing that properly is better than just piling a whole lot of stuff on like a, like a bully base. So you're a therapeutic nihilist. I wouldn't say that. I'm think, I think I'm a, I'd like to think of myself as a focused, um, a disciplined, disciplined person. Disciplined. Thank you, disciplined. Well, otherwise you don't know what's working. Well, exactly, and you're asking then payers to pay for three or four things, whereas if you got one right, then the, then, and the payer could pay for that, that would seem like a reasonable thing. 